Hi, I'm going to um, show you hopefully what to do with your Garmin Vivo Sport once the strap's broken. Okay, what you'll need is you'll need some fastener rings, you'll need two. They're fastener rings, uh, replacement fa fastener rings for the um, the Vivo Sport. They've got a little tag on them, you can just about see it. You need to cut that off. So you can do that with really a sharp pair of nail scissors, like that. Just do the other one. There it goes, turn them back inside the right way out again. Okay. So that's done. You need a Vivo Fit 2 replacement strap band. Yeah, which looks like that. When I first tried this, I tried um, to glue the, um, the Vivo Sport into the strap band, but it was a waste of time. It just didn't, it didn't work. The other thing you need to do is at both ends on the outside, on the inside of the strap band, there are little bits of silicone, which you really, you don't want or need. So you snip them out because they're just going to get, they're just going to get in the way of what we're trying to do. So there's no way you're going to see this. So it's a little stood in one end and then there's a little divider, a little septum in the other end which I'm cutting out. There you go, they're gone. So then I work out which end is the top, which to me is the button side. And then if you, you can see that the strap basically does fit over the Vivo Sport. Then you take one of these uh, fastener rings, put it right over from the end. There you go. And pop it up. It is a bit awkward to do this. Just pop it up over to catch the Vivo Sport and the strap together. Right. It's a little bit awkward to do and when you do one end when you do one end it'll tend to pull pull off till you get the other end on so now I'm doing the other end Nearly there. I thought thought it was nearly there, but perhaps not quite. There we go. It's coming on. These um the fastener rings are quite robust. So I think you'd be doing pretty well to break one. Now I've got that one on. Hmm. But I managed to put it on inside out, flipped it over. So I'll do it again, if you bear with me. If you're still watching. Because the more perceptive amongst you might well have figured out 
exactly how to do this job by now. I'm bogged off, so well done you. Oh no, except you're not watching now, I am. There you go. Now, it's on. It's on, but it's not properly located yet, but you can just move it around, move it around until you've got the, until you've got the gap in the Vivo fit strap over the window on the front of your Garmin. Um, honestly, it does. It looks fine once it's done. It would probably look a little bit better if um, you got a black strap, but I couldn't get a black strap because they're out of stock. There you go. Now that's all done to my satisfaction. Um, there you go. Right, so it's all centered up pretty much now. It's obviously it's it still works, it works fine. Put it on. And it looks okay. The only problem you've got with it. It's that one of the straps, this top strap, oh sorry, getting you with the laser there. This top one is over the charge port. But when you want to charge it, just move it out the way. Move it back when you've when you've finished. Uh, this is I've done this today because I've got a new strap. Um, I bought a small one, it cost £3.50. And previously, there you go. Previously, I'd had a large one, but it was just too big for me. Just far too big for me. So that's also I'd give you the benefit of my expertise, such as it is. Thanks for watching.